Hello. <laughs> we are three friends from Belgium. <laughs> Belgium. Belgium. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I know what you're thinking. Belgium, is that a sandwich? No, 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 no. Belgium, isn't that a, a sort of chocolate? Or is it a brand of beer? Or was it a waffle? A waffle, I think, yeah. No, no, Belgium is a city in, in Brussels. <laughs> Let's just tell you ourselves. Belgium is indeed a country, we swear to God. Yeah. <laughs> If it'll still be a country after the next elections, we don't know, but uh, let's not get hung on that. A good idea. Now, our capital city, Brussels, is also the political capital of the European Union. So you would think we know a lot about Europe. Well, we would have to disappoint you. We know as little of our fellow Europeans uh, as you know about us, I'm afraid. Yes. Well, we have been told that ice skating is very popular in the Netherlands. But which ports are popular in Belarus or in Greece? Now, now Belgians, they like to eat fries after going out of pubs at 4 o'clock in the morning. Now, what do Portuguese or Norwegian people like to eat? Do they like pubs? Um, do Hungarians really eat goulash every day? <laughs> or even more importantly, are women from Ukraine and Sweden really the most beautiful in the world? That's, that's a stupid question. Of course they are. I mean, not, not. Sorry, honey. Okay. But think, how many of your friends come from other European countries? Two? One? None? I think we can easily say that we Europeans don't know each other very well, and that's a shame. Indeed, a shame. Because we are surrounded by so many countries, rich in cultures. So, we decided to do something about it. We want to get to know our neighbors. Mascht is a TV journalist. Matthias works in film production. And Senna is a director. And we wanted to put our audiovisual experience together to set up a platform that gives Europeans a chance to connect. Hello. We are three young Belgians and we've got a plan. Belgians? What are Belgians? Good question. We are the people you see at the side of the highway when you drive from the Netherlands to France or from Germany to the UK. We are the people that live on the parking lot surrounding Brussels. You don't know us? Well, we can't blame you. To be fair, we don't know you either. Even though we live near Brussels, the political capital of Europe, we don't know what the lives of you, Portuguese, Maltese, Norwegians, Austrians, Italian, Polish, Greek, Spanish, French, Finnish, Swedish, Bulgarian, Irish, looks like. We would really like to get to know all of you. Sounds like a plan? That's because of this one. A plan called Hello Europe. We want to place large screens of six meters wide and two meters tall at central places in large European cities. Each time, two screens in different cities will be connected. If you stand in front of one screen, you will be able to see and hear Hello. the person hey. standing in front of the second screen, Hello. as if he or she is standing in front of you in real life. Every 30 minutes the connection changes. That way different people in different places will get the chance to talk to each other. If you happen to walk past one of our screens it will suddenly seem as if you're visiting another country. But there's more. For example, we can use the screens to organize a cross-continental dance-off and arrange an international dating event. Or we can put up a concert with musicians from all across Europe. Theatre groups can tour without actually having to travel. Children can play urban games throughout several cities. You can even have a debate with members of the European Parliament. The possibilities are endless. Every person or group with a fun idea will be able to work it out. Our project is not politically inspired. Our only purpose is to connect people. Technically, Hello Europe is easily achievable. It doesn't even have to be expensive. Still, we need to raise some funds. That's why we want to convince a large sponsor to support our project. To do this, we need your help. Like us on Facebook, give this video a thumbs up, share, tweet, comment, tell us what you think and help us get the word out. The more support we get, the easier it will be to realize the project. With your help, all of us will soon be shouting Hello! So, uh, 
This all started with one phone call from Senna telling us he had a crazy idea to put up screens all over Europe. Now, I thought, this is genius, this is great. Now I can do the Harlem Shake with the Pope in Rome. <laughs> For a couple of months, we researched whether our plan was technically possible. We started the Earth in Motion Foundation and we asked our friends from the production company Minds Meet to help us realize this project. So, the idea is there, but what's the next step? Now, Hello Europe is not a small project. We need the help of a lot of volunteers, sponsors, investors. How can we convince all these people? The answer, the internet. We launched this video uh, simply by posting it onto our Facebook pages. We dreamed about getting 5,000 likes in a couple of months. So on the first day, most of the views logically came from Belgium. The day after that, our neighboring countries joined in. But on the third day, the video had spread the whole of Europe. Now, three weeks later, 40,000 people have clicked through to our website to like Hello Europe. About 20,000 people are following us on uh, Facebook and thousands of tweets have been sent uh, about the project. We had uh, received a lot of massive media attention, actually. Um, not only across Europe, but also, also in the whole world. Many people and organizations have offered to help us. We've even been contacted by the first potential sponsors. The conclusion? We think it's time for a positive European story. We and many others have got enough of the negative atmosphere. Yes. Yes. <laughs> but, 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 this, just to be clear, this is not a commercial for the EU. We want all European countries to be involved, also the non-EU members. And Eurosceptics are more than welcome to sh share and vent their opinions on our screens. Yeah, and, and we don't have any political or commercial or ideological message. Our only message is that of connection. We want to get to know you. <laughs> but <laughs> but we're not there yet. We still need your help. So please like our page on hello-europe.org. And if you want to help us or maybe fund us, feel free to send us a message through our website. Now, we would like to thank you for your attention, and we hope to see you soon again, maybe through one of the screens of... Hello, Hello Europe! Europe! <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs>